to do is we want to start a dialogue. I mean, obviously, there's a limited amount of money in the state and in the country. You know, that you can't have only, you can't make everybody happy. So what our goal is is to make our voices heard, so that when they make these decisions, they make them fairly. That we are not left out of the conversation, and that our benefits and our right to live in the community and be independent is considered and and and, and it means something. Because honestly, if the people with spinal cord injuries, no one really knows, and it's a very rare uh, condition, thank God. And, but no one really knows what, what's involved until it happens to you or someone you care about. Yeah, absolutely. So we need to make politicians mm -hmm. and people in general care about us. And the only way to do that is to share so a story. In the most part, politicians are good people. They're humans and they want to exactly. do the right thing. But um, I've been advocating for eight years. And each time I go down to Washington, D.C., or I visit, uh, visit a congressman or representative's office, it, they're surprised to find out some of the things that they hear. Mm -hmm. And uh, when they're making decisions, they honestly think that they're doing the right thing. Mm -hmm. But when you come in and you inform them and say, listen, you know, this is how it's going to affect my life in A, B, and C, um, they realize that, oh, maybe I shouldn't support this because um, it's affecting the community in this way. So this is where your stories come in. You know, we need you guys out there to say, you know, um, this is what. Um, how it's affecting me. This is how it's affecting me, and I, I need you not to support this, or I need you to support this. 